everybody, it's me, Margaret, carrying on with Vlogmas, and today I'm going to talk about presents. I received some presents in the mail that you still have time to purchase for some, you know, last-minute Christmas gifts that I want you to see. And even if not, you might want to put these on your list if you didn't get everything that you wanted. Really good stuff. Now I'm going to present them in the order of my favorites, saving my favorite for last. Only my personal preference, though, because you might like something else in a different order. But we're going to start with um, something from my friends at Becco. Do you remember when I did a video recently about Becco and La Vivere? It's the same company, two, same people, but two different divisions, so to speak. Loved every product that they sent me, and they surprised me with a couple of other things, too. And I want to show you the first one. This is Weed Barrier Landscape Fabric. <laughs> now it's winter time, so I can't try this stuff out. But essentially, if you've never seen it before, what you use it for is to put it down under the mulch in your flower beds and it keeps weeds from growing up, or at least it reduces the number. It has little fine holes in it so that you can all the moisture when you water can get in there, but slows the process of the weeds coming up. We do have some something similar to this, not by this company, but it is put in our beds, and so I do know that Weed Barrier works. So it's something that you may consider for the spring and have it shipped right to your door. It's very light, but as you can see, a little awkward <laughs> to carry. I had to kind of maneuver it in the car. So it would be really nice to have it shipped right to your door. And of course, while I haven't tested this, everything that they sent me before and even the other product I want to show you in a minute has been top quality. So thank you, Becco, for this weed barrier. Now I'm filming outside because my family is all home and they've got a soccer game going on on TV and the card table is set up for us to be playing a game. And so anyhow, I want to continue on with this. The next thing is from a company that is new to me. They do business through Amazon, so that's easy to get to. And there were food storage containers, glass food storage containers. So let's point out first that this is the link that the company sent me. It's called the MealCon Meal Prep set. Now this particular set was not what I received. I got a, let's see, an 18 piece set. Mine had three different size squares, three different size rectangular, and three different size circular. Some round ones that were not even present here. But I'll have to say that I actually like this set better because the round ones don't fit as well. I like square or rectangular just for space saving in the refrigerator and in the storage cabinet. Now I notice that they do have a smaller set which is just some rectangulars with the tops. So um, this would also be a super option. As I'm unpacking these things, taking the plastic off, I want you to see that they were packaged very well. This little one, for example, to save space in the box, was inside of this bigger one. And you can see that they had padded it so there wouldn't be any clunking around and possibility of breakage. And yet in this one, they did it a little bit different, but works ex just as well. They just turned it upside down so that the plastic it actually fits so well that there isn't any, you know, shaking or jiggling or bumping into the sides. So I'm really pleased with the way it was packaged. Now I have long since been a proponent of storing things in glass because we know, we've known for years, that plastic is not always safe. This is Pyrex. This has got to be 20 years old. I'm not sure if you can actually see the word Pyrex imprinted there, but it comes with these little storage tops. So here you can see that it's called Pyrex Storage Plus. It tells you here that the cover is for refrigerator, freezer, and microwave use. Do not cover in conventional oven, dishwasher top rack only. Well, this can actually go in the oven. This is actually that tempered glass, the same thing as any Pyrex cooking dish, which is a pretty handy dandy thing. Great product, but the tops aren't quite airtight. 
Now none of this information came in the box, which I really wish that it would because sometimes Amazon descriptions do not match what the actual product is. But I am going to trust that this is accurate. I was questioning whether or not you could put these in the oven. And it does say that it is oven safe for over 450 degrees Fahrenheit. So that means that it is tempered glass. And of course, you know, dishwasher and uh, freezer, all the things that you'd want in storage containers. Now this claim right here that they're airtight and leak proof, I can vouch for that. I tested it out and it's very true. Now I'm washing these up before I use them and I thought it might be interesting to see how well the lids work on these. Now they snap into place. You see how they have four little tabs? And I got soapy water in here. Let me dry it off for a more scientific experiment. See, no drips at all. So that's a pretty nice airtight seal on these. And I really like this little vent. Now this is so that you can put it in the microwave and you keep the top on it, you open it up so the steam can escape. And that's pretty handy dandy. All right, so we just finished dinner and I poured my leftovers in here. And I wanna tell you, it's too hot actually to put it in the refrigerator, but I had no problem putting it in here. I didn't have any qualms about putting it in this glass thing because it's thick, very, very thick. So I'm looking at this top and I love this. This is a silicone ring that makes that air tight seal, but it's removable for easy cleaning and it pops right back in there. Isn't that great? Well, I said it pops right back in there. There you go. I like that. See how that fits? Now right now in the holidays, we're putting those things to good use because we are constantly cooking here at home and I have used them a lot since that one little demonstration that I did for you. I truly, truly love these things and I, it would behoove you to make the investment to get rid of all that plastic, even if it's BPA free, because you're not supposed to microwave in plastic, even if it does say BPA free. Heating of the plastic does release some of the chemicals into the food. So that's my personal preference. Having it be able to go from uh, you know into the oven also so it's one less thing for you to wash that's top-notch in my opinion so two thumbs up for those link in the description box below now can I just tell you how excited I am about this bag this is La Viver which means the green life in case you don't know in French this was one of those from that company that I love so much it the same brand that made the little bag it was a makeup carry bag but you could use it for so many other things I give you my I gave you my crochet hooks in it and a knitting bag super super quality product so when I got this it's a camera bag but look at it I love the vintage styling on this first let me say that this is a camera bag or at least it's designed for that but you know how I am I don't limit me to one thing don't just put a name on it I can see where I would use this for everything and as a matter of fact it's even designed to take out the center and you can use it as a messenger bag okay so here is something I'm really excited about and this is the Lobby Vert camera bag and Tyler's going to open it up and we'll read the claims and we're going to see if we agree with what is printed. All right, it says it's a vintage design and premium materials. Lobby Bear's classic vintage camera bag is constructed by top-notch canvas and waxed crazy horse leather. Wait, what is crazy horse leather? Okay, so I looked it up and it says it is a saddle leather and it's you, you apply a special kind of wax and the natural color changes its shade that gives the antique vintage appearance. So do you agree with that? Sure. The, <laughs> now look at the leather. Does it look antique and vintage? Um, not vintage or antique, no. Well, this, it looks new. The, Oh, I see what you're saying, but the st it's supposed to be new, but the, oh, style, yeah, the style is yeah. vintage, right? Uh, sure. Okay, and Oxford cloth lining material is water resistant and moisture resistant. 
and it offers comprehens comprehensive protection for our gear. All right, we're going to check that out. Okay, wait, let's check the straps out next. Okay. Adjustable padded strap to prevent fatigue, and I think that's important in any heavy thing. Is it, is it cushy? Yep. EPE foam, it says. All right, then there's an extra band in the back that is designed to attach the bag to a trolley case, making it convenient for your trips. Excuse me. That would be this. Ah, that is key. You know when Slots you... Slots right down. Yes, exactly. So when you've got a lot of stuff to carry, that just gives you one thing and it's, you can roll it along on your bag. We have a lot of helpers today. It has a detachable and water repellent tank on the inside. All right, look at the bag on the inside. It says it's padded with that same EPE foam, which effectively protects your devices from shock and vibration. Mm -hmm. Although adjustable Velcro dividers, or rather through the dividers, you can customize the spatial pattern of the bag to fit your equipment. Ah, so okay. apparently you can. And it pulls out, it removes. Yeah, but pull out the whole tank. Supposedly that whole square thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. Now this is key for me because there's oftentimes, I don't want to carry every one of my camera accessories. And so I can put that in, say, my backpack going to Disney or for the day or whatever. And it's all padded, so that's terrific. There's also these drawstrings. Oh, even better. Okay, so that can protect it from any kind of dust, dirt, water on Splash Mountain, whatever else that you might run into. Okay, I like that. Let's move on to the inside without the tank. It says, highly compatible and versatile. This versatile bag can serve as a camera bag to hold DSLR cameras like Sony, Canon, Nikon, Olympus, etc. and can be applicable for other vintage cameras. Please refer to specifications to decide whether our bags are suited for your camera. Before you order anything, you should check the dimensions and they do give you a separate picture on here that gives you the exact dimensions. It also converts into a messenger bag. So does that mean that the strap is really long and and yeah, okay, mm -hmm. so you can do an over-the-shoulder crossbody bag by adjusting that. Ah, yeah, okay, cool. Uh, it can keep textbooks, clothes, and other essentials after you take out the tank bag. And a cat. It can take a cat. All right, it says it's got multiple pockets to organize your gear. The inner layer with Velcro closure within the main compartment can hold iPad, books, notes, etc. The inner layer? Like this. Oh, okay, so that would be pad. Oh, okay, mm -hmm. got it. That's extra padding for like, you know, electronics. Um, your flash gun, business cards, charger, SD cards, more camera accessories. A zippered pocket on the back offers easy access to your smartphone or other daily necessities. Very cool. Yeah, Kleenex too when I travel. All right, so would you carry that as a male? Uh, sure, probably. It's, I mean, yeah, it looks, uh, it's, it's certainly, it's maybe a little bit more stylish than I well, would that, typically do, but that, I, I would think this is definitely <laughs> appropriate for a male, yeah. I like that. Okay, I can't wait to use it. Thank you. Now I have a lot of camera equipment and of course I'm using some of it right now so it really didn't make good sense for me to stuff it all in here. But I have different cameras for different purposes. And so when we go someplace I really do want to use this as a camera bag. But I just love it as a crossbody bag too so I'm really really excited about that. So thank you Lava Bear and also I will put these links in the description box below which will take you right to these products. So. I just wanted to give you a heads up. Talk to you soon. Bye.